You're literally not going to believe this, but my fiance wants his dad to check my hymen before we get married. My fiance proposed about eight months ago and everything seemed to be going really, really well. Um, I'm a virgin and so is he. And he said that he wanted to wait until marriage, which I didn't put up a fuss. I was like, it's fine. We can just do that. I'm okay with that. No, I, I, some kind of I see why he's still a virgin. When he came to every girl with that. Uh, nope. I said, right. what? Hell no. Like, what the hell? You don't, you don't pull no BS on nobody like that that right before the wedding. <laughs> it's the Stitch Storm Podcast. Oh, Let's go. You're literally not going to believe this, but my fiance wants his dad to check my hymen before we get married. My fiance proposed about eight months ago and everything seemed to be going really, really well. Um, I'm a virgin and so is he. And he said that he wanted to wait until marriage, which I didn't put up a fuss. I was like, it's fine. We can just do that. I'm okay with that. He told me earlier that in his family, the father always checks the virginity of the bride the night before. And I thought he was joking. I thought it was a massive joke, but he was dead serious. Looked at me in my face, dead serious. He said that the night before the wedding, he wants me to my legs for his father, himself, his brother, and their uncle. I told him there's a fat chance that that's not gonna happen. And he was begging me to go forward with this, begging me. He said, my mom did it. And I just want you to prove to me how much you love me. And I left sobbing. And honestly, I want to call it the entire wedding for this. I, I want to call it off. But at the same time, besides this, we are absolutely perfect for each other. This is really important to him and his family. I don't know what to do. I'm at a friend's house right now and I just need help. What do I do? Yeah, let me tell you something. First of all, I'm going to tell you how Pop's going to check that hymen. <laughs> First of all, why do she why do she need four people? Ah, nah, son. You gonna be like this. Yeah. <laughs> the hymen got work. I heard <laughs> that do y'all got a child? I just need a little child because um I just wanna make sure that you know we, we cover everything that need to be covered up, okay? <laughs> Hey! Oh, oh, no, like this. Oh. Let me say. She ain't no virgin. Nah, she ain't no virgin. She ain't no virgin. The brother come in. By the time she done with all four of them, she ain't no virgin no more. Like, got me yeah, come on. Let him pop that cherry. The brother now, he coming. Well, since they've done the, the front side, uh, why don't you spin that thing around? Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be going down and all I'm, I'm choking on my spit. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> hold on, man. Look, look, look. I got. I got to go to the comments, man. YouTube, I got to go to the comments on this. So the first comment we're gonna say is from Mr. Moderator. He says, "Tell them it's twenty ahead and oh no kissing." Just, just twenty. Just twenty. <laughs> she coming out there with a yeah, with, you at least a hundred dollars. Just money. twenty. <laughs> <laughs> look for all that. Yeah, but I'm. I mean, that's crazy. But why you need four people though? Why you need the, the dad, the uncle, the brother? They listen. That's just that's degrading. They better be O B G Y and N. That's the only way they would be checking my <laughs> Look, wife. That's why I said O B G Y and me, please. You know what? I'm wondering if he. It tests, can't be real. I wonder if he tested her to see if she really would do it. No, I wonder I, if that's some kind of. I test. see why he's still a virgin. When he came to every girl with that. Uh, nope. I said, right. what? Hell no. Like, what the hell? You don't, you don't pull no BS on nobody like that, that right before the wedding? Well, you don't pull no BS on, like, regardless. Period. Wedding or period. You know what no, I mean? No, but I'm just saying, like, he, something like that, you know, communicate that with me, not the night before the damn, damn wedding. Yeah. Listen. Like, that's crazy. I love my dad to death, but it ain't no way in hell. He gonna see where my children came out of. Mm. Listen, 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 sorry. If my dad, first of all, I ain't got no dad. I ain't had no dad. 
My dad was a bum ass motherfucker. But Uh-oh. if my dad ever said, yeah, I know childhood trauma. If my, <laughs> if my dad ever said some shit like that, I wouldn't check your girl to be a virgin. Boy, he'd be, he'd wake up. That motherfucker wake up. <laughs> he wake up in the hospital, oh, boy. Lord. We already checked it, dad. We yeah, checked you into this hospital. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, hell no. Nah. Uh-uh. So look, let's go to the next comment. So next comment from Bologna. Is it, is it Bologna? Well, how the, how do you say bologna? Is it bologna? It's bologna, bologna in bologna. France. I don't know how to say bologna. Yeah, I don't bologna. know. Yeah. All right. From bologna, they want you to ride the redneck train <laughs> <laughs> to keep it in the family. <laughs> choo choo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, why. Give it up, motherfucker, baloney. Huh? That's what I say. Uh, they're from West Virginia. You know, they got, I think West Virginia has the highest cases of incest in the, in the in the U.S. I'm like, this sounds like a case of West Virginia. It right got to be, man. It got to be. It got to be. What do you think, Tay? Look, I already told you, ain't no way in hell I'm doing it. You know what? Forget you. Ain't, ain't that no much way. love in the world, Tay? No, nope, not it, not at all. I'm done. Hey. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. No, ain't no way in hell. I'm going to let your family, your dad, your uncle, your... No, ain't nobody touching me like that. They're not even looking. What the... I don't... No, no. The mother did it. No, I don't... She said, I'm not yeah, her. the mother did it. I'm not her. That's what I said. I wonder if they just trying to test her. But that's my Could whole be. thing. Why do everybody got to put everything on social media? Because that's what people do. But you know what? Then we get the opportunity to, 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 to correct yeah, your thing. Yeah. Hey. Well, we yeah. appreciate it. Just like, what? You know, man. Yes, yes. We love you. Thank you for putting it on social media. Now, man, last comment, y'all. Last comment from guests. He ain't put no name, but you know, I guess he want to stay anonymous. Guest said, "No diamond, no hymen, no diamond." <laughs> listen, oh my God. listen, <laughs> listen. He said, "If this thing don't come back, if, if Mari say uh, not you are the not the mama. husband, <laughs> that's because you know this thing been touched." <laughs> <laughs> No, they're talking about I'm getting my coochie stretched. <laughs> <laughs> Look, by the time they done with it, oh yeah, right. Yeah, man. They probably they, they probably um, you know, a hymen professional. So they probably as soon as she Whatever. she 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 uh, spread eagle, he's like, nope. This one looks a little used, refurbished. No, sorry, Damn. Harper. <laughs> Take this one back. Is it refurbished coochie? <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah you got to get half rice on yes. that coochie. This one looks like it's been on Amazon for a while. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> you you got to send this one back. <laughs> Two-day delivery. Yeah. <laughs> this one was born, This one was on uh, Amazon Prime. Yeah, this one's been used before. <laughs> yeah, you can't return no, this because we no. check cereal. Uh, Amazon Prime got the new stuff. It was on Prime. Poshmark. Poshmark is the used stuff. Hey, Etsy, Poshmark, <laughs> one of them. I mean, she, she got that Timo Gucci. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's your podcast, y'all. <laughs>